you guys, I'm Narusa and welcome back to another video. So today I'm playing Two Point Hospital, as you can see, another new game on the channel, I know it's weird. Um, but I want to start playing more games like these because I do like these games and from what I've seen from previous videos, you guys like them too. And also, let me know what you think of the webcam, it's a little bit scuffed, I, I'm getting my hair cut tomorrow, so I put, well, tomorrow is the day I'm getting my hair cut when you guys see this, so I'm getting my hair cut today, kind of, technically. But we are playing Two Point Hospital. I don't really know much about this apart from it's like, um, you know, you build your own hospital, you have to hire staff, you have to keep the hospital going, people can get infected, there are mods for it, there's DLC for it and stuff like that, and it's got a cool art style, so I thought I'd do it. If you're enjoying these videos, please do leave a like, I'd appreciate that, and um, yeah, let's just do it. So start new game. Also... At Two Point Hospital, over 52% of our patients believe they leave healthier than when they arrived. Okay. Our precisely calibrated so equipment is happen. operated by compassionate healthcare practitioners, many of whom <laughs> have even been to medical school or watched ER. If you suffer from trouble, ER. yeah. let us ease your worries and noggin gently out of your body. Okay. Mm. Just infection is no laughing matter. Put your no. trust and oversized shoes in our capable hands. We're building a brighter, safer future, and hardly anything will stand in our way. You okay. deserve the best. So join us at Two Point Hospital. We're open for new staff, new patients, and a new you. Very Can I nice. go play golf yet? I'm no. teeing off at three. You can't go play golf. I'm sorry. You're a doctor. You have stuff to do. But... I have a new monitor, it's 144 hertz and it's delicious. It's beautiful, I love it. Moving the mouse around is so fun. I've always had 60 hertz monitors and now I have 144 hertz. So if that doesn't deserve a like, I don't know what does. But, oh, it feels so nice. Okay, right, so what are we doing? Who's this guy? This is Hogsport. And here's your first hospital. Click on it to get started. Okay, you know what? I'm actually gonna, because I can now, slide the monitor up so it's a little bit easier for me to see and just so it looks a little bit better for you, because like, you know, if I keep going like that, it's probably a bit annoying. But so this is our first hospital. Begin your career as a hospital administrator. Learn the basics of the job by establishing your first hospital. Okay, very good. Also, I apologize if you can hear stuff outside or in a different room or something. Can't do anything about it. Welcome to Tupor Hospital. I already start building your first hospital. I am. I want to cure some people. Okay, first things first, you'll probably want to have a look around to move around the hospital. Hold the right mouse button and drag. Okay, right, that's easy enough. Move the cursor to the edges of the screen. Oh, that's like League of Legends. I'll probably just do that. You can also zoom with the mouse wheel and rotate the pitch with the middle mouse button. Okay, so I can rotate like that and then we can we can move around like that or we can use WSD. Okay. Alright, easy enough, easy enough. Moving the cameras. Move around. Okay, we've done it. Tutorial is go well. Reception. The first thing that the hospital needs is a reception. Patients will be, will head here when they arrive at the hospital. Let's build a receptionist desk near the entrance. Okay, right. Click on the items. Okay, items. Then reception for a thousand. Oh, okay. Then we can move it. Okay, very nice. So where would a, where would a reception go? Hmm. We could do like a, a cool like sort of, so they come in here. We could do like a little sideways reception here. Maybe, so if I do that. So they come to the reception here and then we could put walls here. Cause I think you can put walls, I think. I'm pretty sure it's that open. So we could put the reception um, here. There we go. So they're gonna come in and walk around to the reception. Great, we need assistant to run the reception. Let's hire one. Okay, click hire. Ooh, okay, assistance. Finley Orange, he's 4.3 grand. Okay, they're all around the same price. Oh, I'll just click my thing. Noddy comfortable. What does that mean? Stamina training. His energy drains at a reduced rate. Works for longer before requiring. And he's basically the same price. He's an extra like 50. We might as well just do him. And it gives us some uh, some like ethnicity in the hospital, so we won't be we won't get called out for being racist or anything. So let's hire this guy. Okay. Oh my god, I can drag him. Poor guy. Spin him around. Okay, right. So let's stick him. Service reception. Wait, is that right? Will he just go there now? General practitioner's office. Before we officially open, we need a GP's office. Okay, right. Room building. To build a room, click on the rooms button and pick from the list. With the room selected, drag out a floor plan of the appropriate size, then place the required items in the room. Okay, that sounds easy enough for this. 
Uh, sorry if the webcam lags too. Sometimes it does when I'm playing it. Oh, he sat down! Look at him! There we go. Noddy comfortable. He's loving it. He's his little, little receptionist now. So, right, we need a GP's office. So, we just drag it like that. And then we put the door on. Okay, where could the GP's office be? So, if we're going to have... We could maybe do... This is all the main, main part of the hospital. And we could maybe save the back there for, like, you know like energy stuff or something like that i'm sure there will be something like janitor's room janitor supplies and stuff that can all be there with toilets this can all be the main hospital and then here can be like the gp room so we'll do from this corner uh so it's okay so that's where the wall okay that's where the wall goes to so we'll do gp doesn't need to be too big we'll do four by three four by three yeah, let's do 4 by 3 and we'll stick his door here. Um, where are we going to stick his door? Maybe... Let's do it there. And then we'll stick his desk. We can rotate it, remember. So we want that there. We'll have him... Maybe... In the middle? <laughs> oh, we can't have him... Oh, okay, right. That's the middle. Okay, right. There you go. You can have uh, that there. Is that it? I think we're done. Then click the green tick. Oh! What is going on? My hair's a mess. As I believe people like to call them, do not hesitate to repress that impulse. I have no intention of playing any of that drivel. Okay, right. 37 grand is a little bit out of our budget for hiring. So we'll go with Natasha. Even though he's four stars, that's too much. That is way... Maybe I need to move this down a little bit. I feel like I'm stretching. Okay, that is way too much. So Natasha, you are going to be the doctor. Charming, inspiring, likes a lie down. Okay, right. That's not good. Suitably... But then again, this is a GP. New applicant in 10 days. Mmm... Should we wait for a new applicant? I think we will. We'll wait for the new applicant and then we'll go. Oh no, we're losing money. We're losing money already. Uh oh, this isn't good. Have they started coming in? Okay, right. We'll wait for the new applicant and then we'll see who we get. Fingers crossed for someone decent. All right then. So, oh, this guy's a little bit cheaper. So he's got stamina and he's got diagnostics. This guy has treatment skill, 10% treatment skill. We'll go for this guy. He's like the, the middle ground. He's the good, the cool, the cool chap. Work in GP's office. Hospital's open. Good news. Our hospital's now open for business. <laughs> Patients are starting to arrive. After they register at the reception, they'll be sent to the GP for diagnosis. Okay, right, cool. Who's going to be our first customer? Rotating and zoom. Zoom out, mouse wheel. Yeah, we already know that. Rotate the camera, blah, 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 blah. Pitch the camera. Uh-oh. What's pitch the camera? Hold the middle mouse button and move around. Up and... Is that it? Eh. We're doing it? Why is he just walking around? Go in there. What? Go on your office desk. Oh. Oh. Messed it up. Ruined it. Stop. Pick up. Eh. Work in GP's office. Right. Stay there. What, what are you called? What are you called? What's his name? Victor Hogsback. Okay, oh, we've got a patient! Ozzy O. Ooh. Mood. Ooh, he's got a bit of a temperature. Hospital's not very attractive, though, he doesn't think. He's treated him! How much was that? 500? We've diagnosed your first patient. The GP has sent you a message. Have a look at the message in the bottom right. Looks like we'll need to build a pharmacy to treat the patient. Okay, right, so we need to build a pharmacy quick. So let's look at this. Doctor's grout is frequently transmitted. Okay, it was grout. In bathrooms, we do need... Okay, uh, get patient to wait. It'll cost seven. Yeah, we'll get him to wait. And then I think it's rooms, pharmacy. So we'll stick the pharmacy... I guess it's before you leave, isn't it? So we'll... St what happened? We'll stick the pharmacy here uh, with the door there just before you leave. And I guess let's stick that there. Pharmacy prestige of two. Okay, and then do we click the tick? I think we do. 
So that is the pharmacy drug mixer. Oh wait. Okay, right. Can we move? Is apparently going to open another of its nature communes for sick people. Okay. More sex than money. Fortunately, I have equal amounts of sense and money. <laughs> so is this the guy that owns the place then? Are we like building it for him or something? Okay, guy, just go in there and you can get your drugs. Build a pharmacy. Oh, we need to hire a nurse. Hire um, nurses. Okay, you're too much. We'll go with Audrey Teeth. Hire. Stick her in there. Work in the pharmacy. There you go. Okay, go open the door for those guys. We've got a working hospital. I keep looking there because that's normally where the webcam is. Ignore my hair, by the way. I have to wear this hat. I'm getting it cut tomorrow. Okay. Now let's see if we have everything to cure a simple illness. Let's see if our staff are up to the task. Fingers crossed they are. Um, I hope they are, at least. So, we're doing well now. So, I guess we have enough money. We could probably build a second GP. But then there'll be a line for that. So, we could maybe even stick... Um, okay, right. So, we'll stick a bench down just in case people have to end up wait, waiting. So, where should we put the bench? Mm, we could put a bench outside the pharmacy. So, let's stick a bench. We probably fit two on there. It's too close, isn't it? Okay, right. So let's. No, I needed to move that. Center it. There we go. And then a drinks machine. Um, let's have a drink and a snack machine over here by the front door. So a drink machine and then a simple snack machine right there too. Uh, we also need bins too. So let's stick a bin. Where can we put a bin? Maybe there next to that, and then we could stick a bin. Mm. Where could we put a bin? Maybe here. Just there. Okay, right. There's a couple of bins around. Uh, do we probably do need an extinguisher. That could be a very useful thing. We'll put this one. We'll put that behind the receptionist. So he can go and use the extinguisher. Don't need a leaflet. We don't need that. We don't need... Okay, right. We don't have any of them. So I think we're good for that. I don't want to build another GP's office in another pharmacy, though. That's the thing. Hmm. I think we're all good for now. Place two fire extinguishers. Oh, okay. Oops. Okay, fire extinguisher there. And we'll stick one up here as well. We'll stick it right under the window. Hire a janitor. Okay, right. Hire janitors. Janitor, we need him to do decent work. So he can upgrade machines and he's cheaper. Any GG? Okay, right. We'll go for Jessica Cucumber. Sounds like, even though he's a guy, he's called Jessica. That makes perfect sense. Okay, hi you. Do we just stick him anywhere then? Uh, okay, right, Janet. You can just chill. You can just chill there. Have a little walk around. Janet will be called to repair a machine when it, its maintenance level falls below 50%. You can also request that a Janet repair it immediately through the items option. Okay, then. Take a look at the new fine dining establishment, Les Souffle Treats. Les Souffle Treats. What delight for the experienced palate this is. The scrambled emu eggs on pickled toast Ugh. are particularly good. I give it four salt shakers. Miami Swing. Okay, right. Keeping people happy. It's important to keep your staff and patients happy to ensure the hospitals run smoothly. Patients will get bored and thirsty and hungry over time. Make sure they have access to entertainment, foods and drinks, a comfy seat when they're between appointments, and if they become unhappy, they will leave to go to another hospital. Okay, right, we don't want that. So I I was going to say, I'll put down a second bench, and I want to put it here. So we can fit two benches here, like that. So we're good for benches now. Uh, we've done the, we need a leaflet stand. Okay, I wasn't going to put one of them down anywhere, but I guess we can put the leaflet stand like... Hmm... Where could we put the leaflet stand? Hey, he's going for a drink. Nice. Leaflet stand there. Right next to the uh, the thing. Our hospital's look, looking pretty decent, if you ask me. Okay, right. New island. New illness clamp discovered. Ooh, clamp. Once this grips the patient, it doesn't let go. Afflicts many lives. Um, afflicts many living statues. And self... Ah, I just clicked my foot. Send a patient for treatment. Okay, right, right. Very good. I didn't read any of that. Don't need to know it. Expensive. Profit! We made a profit! Expenses, six grand. Profit, nine grand. Staff and energy and breaks. Staff will get tired as they work and eventually going to break. A staff room will help. Okay, right. 
So now we can build a stuff room. So I think we should do the stuff room here. Um, right here. And then we'll save that as like a little room. Maybe for the janitor or something. No, because I don't think we need... Okay, we'll give them that. And then we'll stick that there. So that's the stuff room. And then where are we going to put the sofa? We'll put the sofa here. No. Where are we going to put the sofa? Here? Yeah, we'll stick the sofa there. And we'll stick another one there. Because they're going to want to talk to each other, but they're not going to want to be too close. So we'll stick one there. And then I guess we can stick another one directly opposite this one. Like that. How many sofas do you want me to put down? Freaking balls. Okay, right. We'll stick another sofa there. I'm not putting down five. How many? What? I don't think I'm meant to be putting down this many. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yeah, I'm not. <laughs> I'm not meant to be putting down this many. Okay, right. Um. Uh, okay, right. Let's do that. Get rid of that sofa. We don't need this many sofas. We've put down too many. Okay, right. We have these. We have the two sofas. So, how how are we going to do this? Okay, very good. Items. Filter. All. Uh-oh. I don't know how to put stuff back in here. Ooh, okay, this is bad. Okay, it's great, it's fine. Build a toilets. Rooms. So the toilets were going up here, weren't they? So we'll do toilets. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Let's do a decent sized toilets. So we'll do them there. We'll do a door there. Let me turn this. There we go. So a stall there. Stall there. Stall there. Stall there. Stall there. There we go. We'll put a sink. Uh, where should we put the sink? We'll put one there and one there. So there's two sinks. No, we'll put three sinks. Three sinks. Hand dryer. Right there. A bin in the toilet. There. there. Should we put a plant? No. Plants too. That's too extravagant for a toilet. We're not going to put a plant in the toilet. Okay, right. We're done. Boom. We have a toilet. That's very nice. So now, I do want to... I don't know how to... Edit. Oh, there. Okay, cool. Right. Right. Okay, right. So we'll, we'll stick an armchair in here as well. So we'll stick an armchair there, and then we'll also stick a bin in the corner. Yeah, okay, blah, 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 blah. And then we'll stick lockers along this wall over here. So if I can get them the right direction. Our reporter on the mm. field, Sally Fig Blanket, has just returned with her camera crew from another field trip. Okay. As to what she was reporting on, I cannot say. Maybe it tells me anything. He sounds like that guy from Simpsons. I don't know what to say. They do not tell me anything. Like, you know the comic book guy? Okay, cure two patients, get hospital level to three, current level two. Well, uh, I think we can do that in the next episode. We've we've done a lot this episode. So we've got a GP's office set up. We've got uh, a staff thing set up. We've got a reception set up. We've got the toilets done. We have some fire extinguishers and we also have a pharmacy. And uh, yeah, it's looking all good. But I think, could we potentially add a, no a second drug? Okay, right, we can't add another drug mixer, but we could stick a bin uh, by the door. A fire extinguisher in here would be very useful just in case anything... Go okay, right, you're not allowed to... Okay, fire extinguisher there. And then we could probably do with a couple of filing cabinets. So get out the... He's just walked straight out of the room. Okay, done. All right, there we go. We're done. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, please do leave a like, leave a comment, all that good stuff. And uh, yeah, I'll see all of you guys in the next one.